Hey, what is going on, everybody? My name is Insomni Campbell, and welcome back to Odd World Munchies Odyssey. Okay, careful, guys. Splinter security is now on full alert. Mm -hmm. They brought in tons of explosives and an elite team of slings to protect the property. Whoa, wait. Well, I don't see how, but you just gotta get the splinters and force those gluckins to donate their moolah to Lulu. Happy goings. Awesome. Okay, wow. I love how. How encouraging the shaman is. Thanks a lot, man. Thanks so much. Man, I've uh, been looking forward to this level. This one was tricky, I think, from what I remember. I don't remember why it was tricky. I just remember it being a tricky level. I think it's because there's like lots of gates you got to get through. Maybe it was more tedious than tricky. I'm not entirely sure. But anyway, of course, we immediately run off with Abe. <laughs> Don't worry about Munch. Munch is all good. Uh, no, I'm kidding. We're gonna need Munch very, very soon. I think. I actually don't remember all that much about this level. There's, like the shaman said, there's heaps and heaps of explosives. I just wish I could get to the first part. What is going on here? Even the slings can hear me. They're like, ha <laughs> ha, chump. I don't appreciate that. That's just bullying. Hey, can you move? Look at how difficult platforming in this is. It's it's strange because Oddworld inhabitants went from amazing platforming to very difficult. But I guess it's because they're exploring a, a 3D world, you know. All of a sudden, uh, the environments have completely changed. And having to tackle all these new challenges and stuff. Which is actually interesting because I'm guessing that uh, had a lot to do with why Madokans have guns, technically. Because, you know, they have guns. And that... Last level we did, Dead River, the Mud Archers, they have their own guns. Obviously they're not gun guns, they're spruce, uh, spiritual processing weapons. But yeah, they have guns, because the whole, one of the biggest themes behind Abe's Odyssey is that Abe wasn't to have a gun. I love how they like invest, like, what just happened? Let's go over, have a look. But don't look up. No, 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 no. It just exploded randomly. Of course. Dang, dude, direct hit, that was awesome. Yeah, it wasn't allowed again, and uh, I think some of the the rest of the team that uh, Lorn had when he first was creating Odyssey were like, well, why not give him a gun? He needs a gun, you know. That's how they interact. Everyone's got guns. All the games at the time, big massy dudes with guns, and that's how you got it. You, that's how you solve problems. And Lorne was like, no, no, we want to move away from that. We want to do something different. We need to stand out. I couldn't see him. He's right there. And now. In this world, where there's all these, so much more enemies, you know, you're not, it's not just like a one-on-one -on -one interaction, it's one-on-everyone interaction. Uh, they've had to, like, change that. And give the Madokans, I mean, they didn't give Abe guns, they gave the, Abe's Madokans guns. So I suppose it's okay, because Abe was able to possess Sligs who had guns, and through that, could do it. Uh, so I guess it's kind of similar, you're just not possessing them. I suppose I should just blow these guys up, shouldn't I? Oh! Okay, I haven't been found. That's good. I'm gonna just roll with it. We're rolling with it, guys. No! No! Did you say he, he saw me? He turned around and said, like, hey! Ugh. Man. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. There's a timer on this, so I can blitz through it. This way. Oh, I possess this guy and come through here. Ah, okay, I see. I suppose we should keep hitting this way. Oh, no. Oh, I'm with you now. It's on the other side of the door, of course, because you want to get out. In order to do that, uh, you gotta go from the other side. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm with you now. Yep. So we'll just get Munch. Hey, what's happening, Ab? What's going on? <laughs> it's like tiptoe, tiptoe. But yeah, I always really loved that idea because that's what was you know that's how um Otto Dave's Odyssey and Exodus really stood out it's like yeah you had guns but not the the protagonist can I actually get up here that'd be great there we go that was very cool and I didn't notice until just now really that um and I was watching a couple of interviews and and and, and topics and stuff with Lauren Lanning and talking about the games and stuff and the history of Oddworld uh, that I really noticed that and then like a very similar thing with stranger, you know, he's like, oh, I hate guns 
it kind of uh, ties into that as well. You have Stranger who doesn't necessarily have a gun. He's got a projectile weapon. But oh, no, 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 it's not a gun. But it's still playing on that uh, concept of ideals crossing, I suppose. I don't know. Can I get up here? Yes, I can. Oh, you guys are about to have the worst rude awakening. <laughs> also, apparently those bone kegs are from, you guessed it, bone works. Yeah, I read somewhere that there was some cut uh, screen footage stuff. Oh, there's a big bro there. Q. That was originally going to be an exodus. Hey, you can't see me. But yeah, the uh, the barrels, they're made by bone works. Uh, there's like a, you know when you like press the paw print and you like uh, you get more information, it's like a screen like that. And it shows off like a list of products and they use the bone powder from Necrom, the bone powder from the Dokkins, uh, as the gun powder, I guess? Really weird. So I don't know if this is the same ones, I, suppose, I guess it is. I don't see why it's not. That's so loud and so fast, my goodness. Alright, who's next? I love these big bros, they're so cool. And I'm pretty sure Lorne did all the voice acting for them as well. I'm pretty sure Lorne did the voice acting for almost everyone, come to think of it. Almost everyone. I think there's a couple of Gluckins that he didn't do and had someone else do. But for the most part, it's, it's all Lorne. And uh, the only variations is uh, tones and stuff. Higher pitch, I should say. Dang, dude. Get wrecked. Is there anyone else I need to take care of? There's a guy over there. I also need 99 spoofs, so that's something to think about. Oh my goodness. Can I just get through here? Can I just blow this up? This guy's got lots of health. He can tank it. It's fine. He's all good. He's got health. Oh, wait. No, I can't. I can't get through that. Why can't I? Yeah, no. No. I feel like that was specifically made so he couldn't get through. Fair enough. Okay, well I've almost got enough spoots. With A alone, there's there's plenty of spoots. There's more than enough. And last episode, I was like, we found out that I have to get uh, enough spoots naturally without picking up any regenerated spoots. I'm thinking if I have to do it in a row, like I can still get it in this playthrough. I just have to not break that chain. As long as I don't break the chain it's fine like it keeps counting but we'll, we'll see i suppose at the end of the the game we'll know because we're a little bit more than halfway now oh hi uh, so i guess we'll yeah we'll soon see no Abe, 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 Abe. oh no Abe, i'm so sorry my dude and i didn't quick save either all right well you have to be fast we gotta be fast gotta be fast go 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 go, go. come on come on come on come on Right, I think Munch is just through this last gate here. Oh, careful. Careful, 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 careful. So how many do we need? 1200, right? Hey, what's up, dude? For a shake and bacon. Hello, Abe. Hello, Abe. There's my buddy. How is Abraham Lur this fine afternoon? Anyone who doesn't know, Abe's full name is Abraham. And he has a surname, like uh, Latimer Munch. Because Munch is... Last name, well, we say much as, as, if, as if it's his first name, but it's really his his last name. Um, but yeah, Abe has a first and last name too. Well, of course he has a first name. You know what I mean. He has an extended first name. Guys, don't shoot near that. That's explosive. You guys are idiots. Why did I come back this way? Whoa, much. They're fools. They're idiots. Is he dead? Okay, I guess it doesn't matter. Can I possess Munch? Probably be a bit too overpowered if I could do that. Of course I can. I mean, yes, I can. I'm doing it right now. <laughs> Plot twist. Uh, this entire time, Abe is just uh, controlling Munch to his will. Munch is too much of a friendly cat to do anything himself. And Abe's like, well, I've been through this. A similar kind of fate, you know, like our uh, species is on the line. I'll take you and I'll do your job for you. No, I'm kidding, that's obviously not what happened. Abe is, uh, Munch is the big brains behind this whole plan. Yes. Okay, so I think I need to use invisibility here. Because the gates, again, locked from the other side. Like most locks. Most inconvenient, or is it? Oh, maybe it's not. Okay, I guess I'll just sneak through. Sure. Uh, yep, don't mind me. 
Uh, I'm gonna just be a little ghost and I'm gonna tiptoe my way through. Ah. Ah! Okay, now we're fine. My, if, I, if I do this, do I turn back invisible? Ah, uh, visible again? No, I'm totally all good. Wow. Why is this so easy? Why is this fine? Why am I okay? This invisibility is great. I got heaps of time. I think. And if I don't, I'll just possess that guy and I'll, uh, I'll have a good time. <gasps> oh, hi. Hey. Yeah. Okay. I see the problem now. There's a big boy. La da dee, la da da. Don't mind me coming through out of my way. I'm on a mission. I'm on a mission. Oh, oh, yep, 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 yep. Go, 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 go. Tiptoe, tiptoe by the window. Through the window, that's where I'll be. So, what's the well for? Well, 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 where do you take us? Do I have to pull the lever so Munch can. Ah, yes, I'm up here. Hi, fellas. Don't mind me. I'm not doing anything. You don't hear nothing. Ooh, okay. Wow, that was close. I don't think I need to be up there. I think what I need to do is use... <gasps> uh... How have I not been seen? I pressed slap by mistake. I did not mean to press slap. I just did it. It was not intentional. Alright, let's deal with these guys. Don't notice Abe, don't go for Abe, don't break the control. Don't break the connection, that's not what you want. I suppose I do need to get Munch through. Can Munch turn invisible? He can, right? Pretty sure he can. Should I shoot Abe? No, that's a bad idea. What up, fellas? Look up. Up. Yes, there you go. Whoa, hey, where'd you come from? Oh, I think he regenerates. Oh, no. Oh. Uh. Ah, oh, I tried to pick him up. No, oh, that was easy. What is going on? I have no idea. I am completely at the mercy of this game. Alright, we need to be quick. Munch, pull the lever! Can I pull the lever? Can I get, get to it from there? Nope, 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 not good, not good. Run much, quick, be, be faster than that. I don't know, I don't know how to get through that door. I am the confusion. Whee! Hey, what's going on, everybody? <laughs> Where am I? What is much's purpose? Ah, there's a lever I can pull. Good. This maze. Man, getting into splinters is a mission. Such a mission. Oh. Ow! No! Don't attack! Don't attack! Leave me alone! Run! Run, Abe! Just run! Don't worry about it! Just run! Run, 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 run! Ow! My face! Why you gotta hit my face? This is not where I wanted to be. Oh dear. Oh, Munch is getting hit as well. Somehow they found Munch. Yeah, yeah, I know. Yes! <sighs> hey. What's up? Excuse me? What? You put a bet on that? I mean, well, he kind of won. Actually, didn't he? Because Munch died. But how did Munch get discovered? How did that happen? All right, well, let's turn this off. <coughs> oh, but it's smoke coming up from that chimney. Gross. Uh, can we get a better look at the factory? Splinters! Hey, look at that. Look at that, splinters. Can we get a better shot of that? I want to have a look. Oh, I can too. Wow, I can get really far, can't I? What? I've never been on this side. Why did I never think to try this? Oh. Nope. Sorry. I'm out. I'm out. Ignore me. Run, 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 run. Oh, thank goodness that was close. 
have to go back, don't I? Okay, well, all we know now is we just have to speed run it. Easy. I'm good at that. Kind of. Alright, I'm gonna leave much. Abe's fastest. The furthest I can get, the, the better. Yeah, nah, one of them's about to close. Ah! One of them closed, dang it! No, don't you close too! <gasps> Ooh! Oh, I think I'm right. My little tippy toe. It's on an explosive right now. Abe, man, dude. Careful, my guy. Careful. Okay, munchy boy, no dying this time, alright, my dude? Oh, just weave through it. There you go. Easy. Uh, hip. And we're back. Alright, Q. Not a problem in the world. Ah, uh, hang on a second. We might have problems. We might. Nah, 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 nah. I got a plan. I got a plan. I got a plan. Ignore me. Why would you shoot the last gabbit? You need his lungs. We're very far away. Go, 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 go. Oh, hi, you're up here too. Okay, this is a terrible idea. Never mind. I didn't realize he was up there too. Ah, uh, excuse me? What was that? Hey, you're walking on nothing, my guy. You're levitating, dude. No, he did it again! There's an obstacle there. Oh, I hate this camera so much. Abe. Dude, my guy. <laughs> what? Yeah, scratch your head. Exactly. You're floating. Uh, okay. This is these random obstacles here. <laughs> what? Oh, I almost got a bullseye that time. Why did I do that? Why did I do that? <laughs> Look at him. Look at how he walks. He's so funny. Because uh, Munch is so slow and Abe's walk is, is just as fast. So Abe doesn't have to do all that much running. He just walks really fast. Power walks. It's so aggressive. It's like, come on, hurry up. Go faster, Munch. What's taking you so long? I'm a quick save. I don't want to die again. I have a plan. But it's dangerous. I mean, these are all dangerous plans. You know, you're, you're getting Munch and Abe to uh, start a GoFundMe, basically, uh, vicariously through Lulu. Can I do this? <laughs> what is happening in this game? What is going on? I don't know. It's hilarious. Also, why are there all this mines going on over here? Like, like what's up with that? I feel like, ooh, it's just there, you know. Hop in. Thank you. Ow. Sorry. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to get Munch some new wheels. He's going to hop in those wheels. Abe is going to quick save. Mm -hmm. And we're going to go jump on top of the building. And then we'll get Munch to go through to the platform over there. And then Mun Abe will jump down and they'll go inside and they'll be done. It'll be easy. Easy peasy, it's a great plan. We're gonna get shot a bit, but it's a good plan. I only got shot in the butt three times. I think maybe twice. I, I might have miscounted that, but we're good. Oh, and that also reminds me, the uh, flipping mechanic in Soulstorm. Lots of people hate it. Lots of people really dislike the fact that uh, Abe can jump, because Soulstorm is supposed to be more uh, similar to Odyssey and Exodus with the side platform there, right? So it's like, why is Abe able to flip all the time? You're doing so much running around. Oh. We get, we did it, we got out. We did it. I I totally forgot that was not good. Didn't think that was going to work. So I was like, oh, they're standing on the platform too. Two. Boiler room. You boiler room. Damn, is this the level I'm thinking of? There's lockers over there. Oh, no, this is a different level. Whoa! Oh, yes, I remember this level. Right, right. So, anyway, I'll, I'll finish my thought before I finish off. Um, yeah, like, you're doing so much running around, and you're, like, Abe's constantly flipping. It's like, well, that doesn't really seem plausible. Like, it's not really realistic that he's constantly able to do flips, because doing a flip is hard. And running is around is hard, too. No respect. No, I'm just saying my thought, you silly boy. I've also never heard him say, your body's getting shot because I've never put him in a position like that before. So that was cool to hear as well. So there's a few new things that I was saying. So yeah, I don't know. I don't really, like, people are complaining about it. It's like, oh, you should be able to flip. But we've seen 
a flip before and it managed to do the same thing but not really like lands on his head it's kind of like trying to learn how to flip you like land on your back to get used to going around and then you go further each time and hopefully land on your feet the next time and not on your head or because you don't land on your head in a flip no munch is really all about that brain damage isn't he he's got like gadget top in his head and he's constantly landing on it. like no surprise this guy i wouldn't be surprised if this guy was built <laughs> Anyway, I'll leave the episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. That wasn't too bad, actually. It took a little bit, but we got there in the end. If you did enjoy this one, be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more, and as always, I'll see you guys in the next episode of Whatever I Make. Until then, have a good day, have a good night. Bye-bye.